The gut-brain connection, specifically involving serotonin, plays a significant role in mental health, including the development and management of depression. Serotonin is a neurotransmitter, a chemical messenger that transmits signals between nerve cells. While serotonin is commonly associated with the brain, a substantial amount of it is produced and resides in the gastrointestinal GI tract, primarily in the intestines. Key aspects of the gut-brain connection with serotonin and depression. Serotonin production in the gut. About 90 as 95% of the body's serotonin is produced in specialized cells called enterochromaffin cells in the lining of the gut. This serotonin is released into the gut and has functions related to gut motility, secretion, and overall digestive processes. Vagus nerve communication. The gut and the brain communicate bidirectionally through the vagus nerve. This long nerve connects the brainstem to various organs, including the gut. Signals travel along the vagus nerve, allowing the brain to influence gut function and vice versa. Impact on mood regulation. Serotonin is a crucial neurotransmitter involved in mood regulation. It helps regulate emotions, sleep, appetite, and pain perception. Changes in serotonin levels have been linked to mood disorders, including depression. Connection to depression. Depression is a complex mental health condition with multiple contributing factors. While serotonin is not the sole determinant of depression, alterations in serotonin levels or receptor function have been implicated in the development and progression of depressive symptoms. Role in neurotransmitter balance. Serotonin interacts with other neurotransmitters, such as dopamine and norepinephrine, to maintain a balance in the brain. Imbalances in these neurotransmitters are associated with mood disorders, and medications that target serotonin receptors are often used to treat depression. Gut microbiota. Influence. The gut microbiota, the community of microorganisms in the gut, also influences serotonin production and function. Certain gut bacteria play a role in synthesizing and modulating serotonin levels. An imbalance in the gut microbiota, known as dysbiosis, has been linked to mood disorders, including depression. Inflammation and the gut-brain axis. Inflammation in the gut can affect the gut-brain axis and contribute to changes in serotonin levels. Chronic inflammation has been associated with depressive symptoms and conditions involving gut inflammation may impact serotonin metabolism. Effects of diet and nutrition. Diet and nutritional factors can influence serotonin production. For example, tryptophan, an amino acid found in certain foods, is a precursor to serotonin. Consuming a balanced diet with sufficient nutrients can support serotonin synthesis. Individual variability. Individual responses to changes in serotonin levels can vary. While some individuals may respond positively to interventions that influence serotonin, others may require a more comprehensive approach that addresses various factors contributing to depression. Understanding the intricate interplay between the gut, serotonin, and the brain is an evolving area of research. It underscores the importance of considering the gut as a significant player in mental health and exploring holistic approaches to manage conditions like depression, including lifestyle modifications, dietary changes, and personalized treatment plans. Individuals with depression should consult with healthcare professionals for a thorough evaluation and appropriate management. A healthy gut is essential for overall well-being, impacting various aspects of physical and mental health. Here are key components and considerations related to gut health. Microbiome. The gut is home to trillions of microorganisms, collectively known as the microbiome. This complex ecosystem includes bacteria, viruses, fungi, and other microbes. The gut microbiome plays a crucial role in digestion, nutrient absorption, and the regulation of the immune system. 
Diversity of microbes. A diverse microbiome is associated with better health outcomes. Different types of bacteria contribute to various functions, and a balanced and diverse microbiome supports overall gut health. Role in digestion. The gut is responsible for breaking down food into nutrients that the body can absorb. Enzymes and acids in the stomach, along with the activity of the microbiome in the intestines, contribute to the digestion process. Nutrient absorption. Nutrients, including vitamins and minerals, are absorbed in the intestines. A healthy gut lining and microbiome are crucial for efficient nutrient absorption. Immune system function. The gut is a significant part of the immune system. The microbiome interacts with the immune cells in the gut-associated lymphoid tissue, GALT, to regulate immune responses and protect against pathogens. Communication with the brain. The gut and the brain are connected through the gut-brain axis. This bidirectional communication system involves hormonal and neural pathways. The gut microbiome can influence mood, stress responses, and cognitive function. Gut-brain connection. The gut-brain axis involves communication between the enteric nervous system, EANS, in the gut, and the central nervous system, CNS, in the brain. Changes in the gut can impact mental health and vice versa. Gut lining. Integrity. A healthy gut lining is essential for preventing the entry of harmful substances into the bloodstream. Intestinal permeability, or leaky gut, can lead to inflammation and contribute to various health issues. Fermentation. Fermentation is a process in which gut microbes break down indigestible fibers into short-chain fatty acids, SCFAs, SCFAs have anti-inflammatory properties and support gut health. Probiotics and prebiotics. Probiotics are beneficial bacteria that can be obtained from certain foods, e.g. yogurt or supplements. Prebiotics are non-digestible fibers that nourish the growth of beneficial bacteria in the gut. Impact on chronic diseases. Imbalances in the gut microbiome have been linked to various chronic diseases, including inflammatory bowel diseases, IBD, irritable bowel syndrome, IBS, obesity, and certain autoimmune conditions. Factors influencing gut health, diet, stress, sleep, physical activity, and the use of antibiotics can all influence gut health. Lifestyle factors play a significant role in maintaining a healthy gut. Symptoms of poor gut. Health symptoms of poor gut health may include digestive issues, bloating, gas, constipation, diarrhea, food intolerances, fatigue, mood swings, and skin problems. Gut-friendly foods. Consuming a diet rich in fiber, fruits, vegetables, fermented foods, and whole grains promotes a healthy gut environment. Hydration. Drinking an adequate amount of water supports digestion and helps maintain the mucosal lining of the intestines. Avoiding excessive antibiotics. While antibiotics are necessary in certain bacterial life-threatening situations, excessive use can disrupt the balance of the gut microbiome. Antibiotics do nothing for viruses. Let me repeat, that antibiotics do absolutely nothing against viruses. Maintaining a healthy gut involves a holistic approach that includes a balanced diet, stress management, regular physical activity, and other lifestyle factors. Prioritizing gut health can contribute to overall well-being and may have positive effects on various aspects of physical and mental health.